Hey everybody, Pastor Danny Coverstone, uh, Brooksville, Kentucky. Had a, another dream that compiled over two nights, August 26th and 27th. And I woke up with a little bit different understanding of this dream. I'm just going to share the dream and let everybody else pray about it, think about it, look at it. I dreamt that I saw people all over America during the daylight hours uh, in various places. I saw people in Wall Street, suits and ties. I saw people at church. I saw people at the park. I saw people at high school games. <laughs> I saw people at malls. I saw just people doing normal things. It looked more normal than before uh, COVID, as you can imagine. Uh, nobody was wearing masks. There were no concerns as to disease or illnesses or anything going on. People were acting like 2020 had never happened. Uh, and then suddenly a lot of those people started to look up like they'd heard something. Uh, there was no noise in the dream that I heard. I just saw people just look up suddenly and like looking around like that. Uh, and then a bunch of them, not all of them, but a bunch of them just took a deep breath like, <gasps> like they were holding their breath, like they're about to jump into water or something. And other people had not heard anything, though. And there was like people, the person talking to me just kept talking, looking at me as if they couldn't even tell I was holding my breath. They just kept talking and engaging with me. Other people, once again, were looking, those people who looked around saw something coming or heard something, felt something, sensed something, took a deep breath and were holding them. Everybody else were just kept doing what they were doing. They were not even aware that people were holding their breath around them. Um, and the people holding their breath were not straining by any means, not, not, not hurting to hold it in. They were just very calmly watching the landscape around, eyes watching, looking around while holding their breath of what was happening. And then I saw waves of water uh, coming over the landscape and uh, the surrounding mountains. The, the boundaries of the United States of America were mountains. So take the outline from California all the way to New York. It was all, the boundary of the entire nation was all mountains. And coming over the mountains was water. Now, not like tsunami waves, not like rushing waves, just water, just steady, just steady water. And it was just brilliant blue, like ocean blue uh, water. It wasn't dirty. It wasn't murky. It wasn't clear and transparent. It was just blue, tra just blue ocean water coming over slowly. And um, it was like the water was going to fill up the pool of the mountains around the United States of America. Um, now, the people who were holding their breath acted like they hadn't even seen anything scary coming. The people holding their breath were not worried, were not scared, were not leery, were not panicking. Once again, they just kept remaining very, very calm. Uh, they stood there holding their breath. Some of their families by their sides holding their kids' hands. They did not run, but they stood squarely in place of where they were. The others, however, when they saw that water, they were screaming. They were panicking. Um, they were running, but they had no place to go. And I could also see them just looking, pointing, making a fist, looking in the sky and cursing God, uh, cursing the sky and the God that they believe lived there. Uh, and the water was coming up to their knees. And people just kept yelling and screaming. And once again, the people holding their breath were just calm and relaxed. Um, so there were, there were two distinct groups, those who were holding their breath, and those who hadn't even tried to hold their breath yet. Uh, one group was running and caught off guard, while the other group was very, very calm. And out of the group holding their breath walked the man that I've seen in the previous dreams, the white figure who'd always said, brace yourself to uh, the hospital internist or the, the, the person in the hospital, to the person who hung the bucket on the, on the sap uh, tap uh, in, uh, among the maple trees. He walks out and he held up two fingers on his right hand, and he said it clearly, stay braced, but don't breathe just yet. So once again, he held up two fingers and he said, stay braced, but don't breathe just yet. I had this over uh, Monday night, the 26th, and Tuesday night, last night, the 27th. Uh, not a whole lot more in that dream, but that's what I saw. I saw the, the, the brace yourself figure. Uh, anytime I have one of those dreams with that person saying, brace yourself, I'm going to share it. Um, I know we're seeing a lot of tumultuous stuff being to happen, especially in uh, Philadelphia. Uh, we've seen another city, San Bernardino, had a situation. Uh, all sorts of crazy things are happening in the news. And so I'm sharing this. Uh, once again, it doesn't fit the 2020 timeline. I never saw anything with 2020. It was just everything was normal. Everything was daylight. Um, Yet the people holding their breath were very, very calm and together. And I'm going to take it very, very easily, very quickly. Those are believers who are not panicked about what they see. But the, the, the figure said, brace yourself, but don't breathe just yet. Almost like there's more coming than we can imagine, more coming than we can see. Uh, whether it fits the timeline, I don't know. I'm just telling you the dream that I had. 
that's what I saw, and I just simply wanted to share it. And uh, for whatever it's worth, there it is. So thanks for watching.